Vittoria seems like any active ten-year-old girl. She loves to spend time with her parents and brother Daniel. She even has a pet toucan named Samson. Yet Vittoria has done something most young girls haven't done. She's planted a small group that meets every week to study the Bible. One day a week, Vittoria climbs into her small canoe and paddles her way up the river that her family lives on. The river is part of the Amazon River Basin, which covers this part of northern Brazil like a million slithering snakes. With skill and determination, she makes her way upriver to the houses of friends that she picks up to take to the Bible study. Vittoria explains why she's willing to navigate such a big river in such a small boat. Eu tive a ideia de assinar canoa porque eu não tinha. I had to take a canoe because I had no way of going in a bigger boat. I'm too small, so I had to go with a canoe. Sometimes her brother comes along to help out. And when the canoe is full, they make their way to a path that leads them into the jungle. They walk on top of fallen logs, trying not to fall off into the thick mud that covers the forest floor. They finally come to a small hut on stilts that overlooks another outlet of the river. This is the home of another friend who has offered to host the Bible studies, as long as he's allowed to attend as well. The young people start with prayer and quickly open the small groups magazine produced by the South American Division to use as a study guide. They also use the Sabbath school lesson to guide their studies. After a discussion on the topic of the lesson, they sing songs and close with a prayer. Victoria gives a simple reason for wanting to tell her friends about Jesus. Because I want to be in heaven with them. Three of Victoria's friends have been baptized because of her witness, and they are inviting more friends to their weekly lessons. If a young child is willing to brave a big river to share her faith with her friends, just imagine what we all can do to help spread the gospel around the world. All we need is a little faith, courage, and the work of the Holy Spirit, and we can do wonders in Jesus' name, just like a little girl up on the Amazon River. What a